I never actually thought I'd be making this video about Matthew because it was months and months ago. However, because he has so wonderfully found my YouTube channel and has started an argument thread, um, I feel as if it's important to talk about what happened in Bend as to not worry about have my hundred other shadows worry. In, um, in May, in April of 2023, I joined a, um, a Facebook group for LGBTQ teens. I mentioned that in the Tash video, and, um, Matthew was one of those toxic people that I, that's Chuck, that I met on there. Um, basically, Matthew would take advantage of the fact that, um, I have Asperger syndrome. I prefer not to speak of it much. However, um, Matthew knew this and therefore took advantage of me through riling me up thinking it's funny and then when I inevitably explode on him, he quote unquote panics and then I'm the one made out to be the victim. Well, no, not me, the victim. He is. He's the victim whenever I, that happens. And the whole thing with Chris, basically we were in a polyamorous thing. I wasn't the only one that he was manipulating at the time. It was also Chris for about a year, three years. From what I know, that's how long they were dating. As far as I'm aware, I don't know much about that. But based off what Chris has told me, he was unfortunately manipulated as well. Um... Um, and another way Matthew manipulated me was through faking numerous teen pregnancies because he's trans. He, he still has those parts for making babies. He faked multiple of those, faked multiple friends. He's basically a pathological liar. Um, and unfortunately I fell for that for months